What's up guys, Shane Starnes with Droid Modder X, and as you guys know, there is a root method for the Nexus 6P. The only thing holding many of you back from rooting your devices is the fact that it requires an over-the-air update. So if you're like me, you went directly to your settings, you went to system updates, check for an update, and it's telling you you're currently up to date, but you know you're not on the official over-the-air update. In order to root your device, you'll need to be on MDB08K. The reason for that is because Chainfire built his modified boot image based on that build. Manually flashing the over-the-air update is super simple. Enough of you have requested this video that I decided to go ahead and make it for you guys. Let's go ahead and get started. To apply the over-the-air update, you're going to need a couple of files. I'll be sure to include a link in the description. The first thing you're going to want to do is grab the Fastboot. So grab the Fastboot here. Go ahead and unzip this folder to your desktop. Okay, and then go to the next link here and grab the over-the-air update zip. Okay, so once you have grabbed that over-the-air update zip, go ahead and drop that into your Fastboot folder. So you should have your Fastboot file and that over-the-air update zip. Do not unzip the Fastboot file. Okay, so moving right along, go into your settings. Go down to about phone, go to the build number and click on that build number seven times until it says that you're a developer. Go into developer options and make sure that OEM unlocking is turned on, USB debugging is turned on. And then you're just gonna wanna plug your phone up to your computer. Okay, so once your phone's plugged up, go ahead and set that to the side. You're going to hold down shift and then right click inside of your Fastboot folder. Go to open command window here. Type in ADB devices. Okay, you should see your device attached there. If not, you'll need to install your USB drivers. I'll be sure to include a link in the description of where to grab those USB drivers for the Nexus 6P. Once you have verified that you are connected and the computer sees your phone, type ADB reboot boot loader. Okay, so once you're in the bootloader screen, you're gonna volume down to recovery mode. This will boot you into stock recovery if you haven't already flashed a custom recovery. I've already flashed Team Win Recovery Project. For me, it'll boot into Team Win Recovery Project. But the option that you're looking for in stock recovery is to ADB sideload. So it's the same option as what you'll be using in Team Win Recovery Project, but you can also do this from your stock recovery. If you're not rooted yet, then that's probably where you'll be. In Team Win Recovery Project, you would just go to Advanced, and then you go to A to B side load. Okay, so the command you're just gonna type simply is ADB side load, and then you'll put the name of that OTA zip. So just copy that and paste it here, and then just add the zip at the end. If it doesn't already populate, hit enter. And then that will go ahead and flash the zip. Okay, so when you are done, you're just going to reboot your phone. All right, so now whenever you go into your settings about phone, you should now be running the current version. Uh, for now, it's MDB08K. All right, guys, hopefully that assisted you. Many of you have requested that video, uh, which is why I've decided to go ahead and post it. If you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel for more content like this in the future. You can find more of me at droidmoderx.com. Follow me on Twitter at JordanModerX. Thanks, guys, for watching. Be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.